Hey guys, welcome back to Wild Arms. Where you last left off, we did it. We defeated Mother, the queen of the demon race. Unfortunately, the other knights, the other demons, the quarter knights, are still alive, and it turns out that the blue robe figure who helped us was Siegfried. And of course, he probably, I guess he figured, you know, getting killed with the rest of the planet and being devoured by their mother wasn't exactly the best way to, you know, exist, so they helped us kill mother. But now, Emma's formed her own little, um, we've gone back to Adelheid now, uh, Emma's formed a sort of <laughs> self-absorbed agency where reconnaissance and whatnot. I'm, a, I'm sorry that the video cut off last part. I ran out of memory space on my recording thing. I guess I got kind of greedy with the time. Yeah. Oh yeah, and how we escaped, we, uh, Bartholomew, Jane and stuff were apparently followed us, somehow got to where we were and were able to get us out in time. That's how it worked. Yeah, so we're back at Adelheid. Now, if you noticed, the original theme of Adelheid is back. The town's roofs are fixed. No more leaks. <laughs> Thank you, Engineer Tom. And we got money. Let's see if we can donate. Yeah. From cobblestones to... to roofs. We've come a long way since our town was destroyed, but our job is not done yet. Will you please donate 5000 You are a kind person. Yeah, I know. I think this is the mayor. Mayor Cuthbert. We are slowly regaining our strength. Yeah. We can't, maybe we should go in and out of town a few more times, you know, donate. The real power of the Guardians lies within the souls of the people. I wonder what would happen if the, guard, if the demons were working on getting the other golems. Ah, yeah, and I also forgot to mention that. Turns out Lolithia, the ice golem that we, you know, excavate and stuff, and we, we saw back then, like, get taken by demons, has been reprogrammed. We fought Lolithia, we beat her somehow, and unfortunately, we didn't get her on our side. She's gone for good. We don't know much about ruins in the outer ocean. Yeah. Temple ruins aren't the only places where the guardians were worshipped. There are other sacred grounds. Passing dream chasers say that they saw an object fall from the sky and land in the inner sea. I think you mentioned the. I think that's the photosphere. There's a way to get to the famous Armmeister in the east. Go through the outer ocean to the east. You might find something there. Interesting. But before that, now that we have hurt Cecilia's teardrop and with Jack's grappling hook, hook, we can actually go somewhere. Like, for example, back to Lithia's ruin. Lithia's tomb. If you recall, there was actually a grapple point. Way back when. So we can finally get it at last. Yeah, this place really has no significance other than that chest, huh? Lithia's gone now, and... And I wonder about the other... Really? A crest graph? Well, it'll come in handy still. So I'm gonna cut back to the memory temple now that we have Cecilia's, Cecilia's teardrop back. And we're back. So now we have her teardrop. We can go through the door. Avoid that portal and use it on the store now. A crest graph and actually a sort of new item, which we, but of course random battles. I know it's been okay. A crest graph, so more crest graphs for us. Holy Parcel. Now, let's see here. That, I believe. Huh, only Cecilia can have it. Absorbs Emmy's magic as MP. Well, I just want to show it off. I guess you could find some use for it for Cecilia only, though, but... Still, I guess it could be useful to you, you know, if you want to keep up with magic and not cast attacking magic spells. I just wanted to show it is all. 
And I think that's about it. Now we can... Actually, let's go in and out of town, try and see if we can donate some stuff. Okay, we're back to the donations. I just got back in town, he needs in our donation. We need to provide housing for the homeless. Would you please donate 10000 Thank you. Now we can have people return to their homes. And let's see if we can do it again. Okay. The town has finally returned to normal, but we still need more money to finish the job. 20000 Oof. I don't actually have 20000 Uh... Let's sell some stuff real quick. You know what? On second thought, um, let's just come back here later. So, where we have to go next? So, if you see... This little curve right here is actually where we have to go next. If you recall, there was a whirlpool over there. So... Let's do it. Yeah. Ah, sailing music. Okay. So, when we approach the whirlpool, the teardrop shines. The teardrop shines. Yes, now that the teardrop is actually reacting to something. The teardrop is transmitting the thoughts of the guardians. It's very faint though, I can't seem to link up with it. If we just knew the name of the guardian who's trying to contact us. Yes, so what you actually have to do in order to enter or, you know, contact this guardian or whatever, we actually have to go to Rosetta Town. So let's cut to get into Rosetta Town. And here we are. Rosetta Town. This is the town of Rosetta. We have some problems here right now. Hmm. The best way to control crime is preventing crimes, not per prosecuting criminals. Tell me now if you know of any strange activities. Okay. I wonder if this dog says anything different. Uh, nah. Anyway, it seems the uh, mayor is all cured up now, so we can actually talk to him. You, back again? What do you want? Don't mess with me. Do you know about the large vortex to the east of here? The, str the strait that joins the inner sea and the outer sea is where the guardian of the ocean, Lucadia, lives. The entrance to his lair is supposed to be somewhere nearby. Rosetta is suffering from a lack of trade. Ships come, come through here with reports of dragon attacks. Can you look into this matter on behalf of our village? Tch, fine. Well, we have to gain access to the outer sea and ocean any sea anyway. Let's go visit Mariel, actually. You know, get another flower from her. Say hi. Father was looking for you. Not that I have anything to do with it. Hey, Mariel. Thank you. All I can do is give you these flowers. Oh, that all you have to say? Really, Meryl? Okay. Wow, this luck was weird. Now Jax is the one that's gone down Well, they've gone up. Maybe it changes as you level up or something. So let's cut back to that whirlpool. Now that we have the name of the sea guardian, we can actually go to that whirlpool and something else will happen. Okay. So now, teardrop shines. <clears throat> wow, this is incredible. Lucadia, the guardian of the ocean, is contacting me through this teardrop. It's so strong, I can feel it within my entire body. It's saying... I understand, Lucadia. I'll use the teardrop. What? What's happening, princess? <laughs> Wooey! What is this? Th what is this? The mystery spot? The mystery spot. <laughs> Look at him. All bug eyes. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, we're getting uh, transported. Uh, uh, hang on. There, fixed. We can go back anytime we want, but, you know, we don't want to. 
yeah, we want to get through this. So, welcome to this uh, dungeon. It's a little bit um complicated, just a bit though, but not entirely. All these staircases. You know, let's start from the beginning. The one, the one on the right. No, 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 no! <laughs> oh god. Oh wow. I'm an idiot. Oh well. But now, see, it's called the Dragon Shrine, so we can just go back whenever we want. <laughs> Oops. But at least you got to see that. So, whatever. I believe there's a chest hidden here. I, I think. Really? There's nothing here? It's just a trap? Well, for us to run into monsters? How can there not be anything? <sighs> whatever. Don't do that. Come on, it's not cool. Whatever. And this is the only other way to go, so... Okay... Ah, here we go. Magic carrot. Lucky card. The same music as in the Guardian Shrine, too. Ah, yeah, this puzzle. It's a little annoying. Uh, I forget the how to do it specifically, but... Let me see. Mm. I have to get over there. Uh. Uh. How do I do this? Uh. Wait. Hey, see so this pocket watch. <laughs> Been a while since we've used that, huh? Mm. Oh, well. <laughs> there it is. Okay, so. Not that complicated at all. Hey, look, a save point already. There are random ba- Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Okay, that was a long stretch. I probably missed a whole bunch of things. Deep po- d Deep pond pones. They're actually weak to lightning. You've probably seen a variant of them, you know, the it was pink and whatnot and whatnot. So you know it's a recolor. <laughs> Use water gun. Ugh. Again, need experience, so if you want to spend some time just leveling yourself up for HP and strength boosts, be my guest. Ah yeah, so there's a bunch of these little uh, puzzle things here, block puzzles. So what we want to do is uh, move these. Yeah. 
Yeah, chest for our troubles. Jeez, crust graphs. Let's start from the bottom and make our way up. Yeah, okay. That was the... So, yeah, they start off easy and stuff, and then they work their way ups. Up. Ups. Just how many crest crafts do I have? <laughs> Sixteen. Wow. Hmm. I know the solution. All I have to do is... Okay. Wow, they really want me to stack up on magics. Actually, I kind of know why. But, you know, I've got plenty of crest graphs. These are actually useful. You actually, I believe you do need to do these. Now, this one is a little tricky. You don't want to do that right away. You just have to move it up as close as possible. And then you do the third one. Shining cape. Thank you. Random battle. Anything new? Naga. Okay. Whatever. They're also with the spark. Sweet. Wow. Sound like a cat for whatever reason. Whatever. Okay, let's get to work. Ah, yes, this one's actually kind of tricky. Now, you think you have to push this block all the way down. You do not. You actually do it up to here, and then it'll go in. It's a trick. So both of these. Uh, hang on, guys. Okay, I'm back. Uh, turns out that there was another little error with this block. Huh. That's odd. Okay, jeez. That was weird. <sighs> but now I got it. Ah, yes. You do this one for the final item. Her, uh, Cecilia's vase. Magic Vase. When used by Cecilia, it produces an endless flow of water. She can use it to put out those difficult fires. Yeah, like some of her other items, you know, actually, you know, like her teardrop, it's using endless water. Yeah, right. All you do is press square, and yeah, just unlimited number of water. It's plot related. Well, it's, you know, side quest slash, you know, plot related. If there's ever a fire that's randomly there, you can put it out, but... 
really, that doesn't make much sense, because, like, we have spells that could probably put out any type of fire. Why only from this vase? But we needed that va and we needed that vase to progress. Up there. Actually, let me check real quick if I've forgotten anything. Okay, we're good. There was no other place for me to go, so we're nearly done with this dungeon already. Just fix this camera. There we go. So, let's do it. As you can see, there was this fire, and that's why you can just crash into it. Ah, the switch is shaded a different color. Other than being gold, it looks silver. Another block, sets of block pushing. I believe that we have to go the other way to get this. Give Rudy some more concussions. Oops. Yeah, hang on. Let's try this again. Uh, what am I doing? Uh, <laughs> wait, hang on a sec. Okay, so I was right the first time. I'm, I am supposed to actually go this way. So, my bad, I forgot. Yeah, so we're supposed to do this. Then that. And that. I forgot. Mm. Derp, derp, derp. Okay. Switch to the vase. Good. Magic water vase. Ah, duplicator. So now let's proceed. Other side. Dragon Lucadia. Welcome, warriors, and the innocent one. I am Lucadia. I am the eternal flutist whose music permeates the ocean from the depths of the dra dragon shrine. The teardrop in its rightful hand called you over here. Mother has been defeated and is now my nourishment. Yet the dreams of the demon race are not over. Tell me, Lucadia, what are they planning to do now? How was Siegfried going to destroy the Deep Guardians. The Ray Line. It's the ar artery of life which connects all of us together and maintains all life on the planet. After our strength has weakened, we decided to combine our strength through a device the Ills had left behind. From inside the Ill Pyramid, the network began to pump life energy throughout Filgaia. And if we sever this Ray Line, we can clean this planet for good. Oh, Lady Harkin. I'm not sure about this, Zeke, but here goes nothing. Harkin! I came for the big fish, the Sea Guardian, but this is a pleasant surprise. I always wanted to fight you again. We were meant for each other, you and I. We were born, we were both born to fight. On guard, let's see what you got. Yep, so we're going for three on one against Lady Harkin. And eh, despite like how we fought her before, though she's not a big deal. I'm actually, yeah, we'll use it. Who cares? She actually does have something to steal, so we'll do it. But she's fast too. 
you know, turf fast draw and stuff, really, this begs to laser silhouette. Well, you didn't really do any laser animation, all you did was stab me with your scythe. This, it begs to be in real time action, though. Man, I wish this wasn't real time action. Be so fitting. Laser silhouette. Yeah, she's pretty strong, but if you're keeping up with healing, slowing her down would be nice too. You'll be fine. Oh, come on, twice? Oh, wow. <laughs> Rudy is a beast. Guilty Blade. Hmm. She has the power of the triangles as well. That's her fast draw. Sure, let's mystic a potion berry. What she has on her is actually just a secret sign. But I want to try and get it. But if we don't, it's fine, I guess. Twenty sixteen. <laughs> yeah, I think all she has is laser silhouette and well. <laughs> Guilty Blade. It's kind of sad. Want to analyze her? Harkin. Nope. <laughs> Nothing. Guilty Blade. You're all. I hereby declare you guilty. Not that powerful, but whatever. Mmm, I wonder if Valkyrie will... Uh, you know what? Let's try Vortex. Come on, Hampan. You're not digging deep enough. Eh, eh, eh. What are those things on her head? Little wing things? There's 344. Whatever. I believe she's almost dead anyway. Ah, there it is. Okay, so now there's nothing stopping us. Let's go all out and take her down. Oh, thanks, Rudy. I guess I was wrong about you, baby. Really? Go back to the ship of the blow for my Azrael. What? <laughs> she turns her back to us. But uh, something's happening, actually. Despite the music. What? I, I can't move. We're going to continue this later, sweetheart. That was odd. So, they, are they were after the raid line. It's not easy to destroy an entire planet, even for the demons. Shaman child, use my powers to defend your planet. Triton ruin. Essentially a stronger water type attack from Stoldark, so, you know. Pretty nice. Her sword technique looks just like a fast my fast draw, but it looks a little different. <laughs> fast draw hint. And actually, the funny thing is, I'm going to tell you right now, that is actually the Guilty Blade that we just saw her use. Yeah, he actually is copying her now. <laughs> That's kind of interesting, you know, actually utilizing her power. But let me tell you right up, it's nothing that special. And now the way is open for us. When we come back, let's go exploring the Outer Sea. <laughs>